Thanos, Oral. That's why he put Europe all the way over wherever he put it. Let's play church! How about Dodge Glass? <clears throat> Yo! I see these townspeople caught up in all this segregation, Michigas. What is happening to our community? Witness the second coming of Mora Laurel next Sunday at 12.15 on Adult Swim. the first half of the first note. Yeah, I your, your dick. Yeah! No. He's look like a big asshole, and I am not that. <laughs> look, he's just playing around, but I'm serious. You will soon be paying... Nothing, right? Well, let's, uh, let's, let's hope not. Magazine war! Better. Wait a minute. How are you gonna eat it after I eat it? Look. You know, uh, happier songs about partying. Party, party, party. Hey, let's party. I have an idea. Gentlemen, we have a time machine. And this? Probably so definitely probably not this week. Just ballpark it for me. I don't know. <coughs> You're not back. And? No, uh, no apparent trace of cancer in the lymph nodes. Oh, God. Thank Woods yet. Now that Awesome X has defeated all the supervillains in the city, okay. it's time Xander Cruz got focused. Xander Cruz. Uh. You're Awesome X. Awesome uh. X, yes. Maybe read a newspaper once in your life. Screw it, shoot it. Bring it, you cyborg sons of bitches! I'm all shot up, man. You ain't gonna die. Say the freaking word. <laughs> I mean, is this... Americans would be more plentiful if they hadn't traded their land for casinos. Well, cowboys never even existed. They're just... This is for the best. <laughs> Give them these pills every two hours. Hobbs? Hobbs? Mars is amazing! The Veronicus! No one's ever gone wild! Revenge! Yes! It's an actor! That stuff gave me cancer, too! Well, but... In hell, you d ass clowns! Didn't the dead paparazzi get a memorial, too? Yeah! Straight from New York City. New York City? Oh, honey, watch out. Dad, he was just trying to go to the bathroom. What the oh. hell is that? You monster! What are you doing to my daughter? Dad, we were having sex. So, what have you guys been up to? Got a new bell yesterday. Ooh, a new bell. Loving it. Really cool jingle. Ah! Oh, whoa! Oh, no! Come on, honey. Me. I think I should drive.
Maybe I'm not prayer correct. Anything could set them spiraling into a depression. A bad photo, a slice of pizza before sleeping, and their world can immediately turn up. Where the blues began, right here where we stand in blind hall and Davenport killed his wife. Dude, has anybody got any SPF? I'm a. Uh, oh, I got the hit in the balls with the train cinder block. Right now, in the Nate, ball. the blues devil lived down here. If you want to be a real blood man, you gotta sell your soul to the devil. Well, that's gonna have to be rewritten. I'm seeing other refusions too, page seven. The advance not recoupable of all and or any monies construed. Ah! I can feel pain again. I'm ready. We just received very. was fine. Hell, they look good. The damn gallbladder's what turned on her. Fix it. I got to find the money. <sighs> You're right, son. But it's gonna take a lot of work. What? what when's Molly Hatchet come on? Why? So you can bed down with the rhythm section again? See? Yeah. So She's the sheriff. Uh, maybe I'll try. See, real? You know, it's my favorite. Hmm. Thanks. Smoke now. Here it goes. Not worth it. Christmas. What do you give someone who has everything and more? He can heal a sick, so don't give him an aspirin. He can walk on water, don't give him more support. Every time you hear a bell, an angel burns in hell. If the Lord were alive today, what would you give him this Christmas? Give them a $20 gift certificate at Pizza Joe's. Merry Christmas from Pizza Joe's. <laughs> and now back to the joyous sounds of Christmas. All I want for Christmas is my two front eyes. All I want for Christmas is my two front eyes. Oh, for goodness sake, do whatever he wants so he won't scream anymore. But, Mom, I'm all the way over. Praise the Lord. We're here. All I want for Christmas is my two front eyes, but I haven't been a good enough boy. <laughs> I'd like to wish a very special first Merry Christmas to our Jews for Jesus friends. You know, during this joyous season, it is easy to forget the true meaning of Christmas. What Christmas is really about is the birth of the cute little baby who would grow up to die an unbelievably horrible death for our sins. You know who I'm talking about. Jesus. Jesus our Savior, born from an attractive virgin named Mary. Jesus was an unplanned birth that really made a name for itself. Why, if Joseph refused to let the baby grow within Mary, who knows what this building would be right now? 
maybe even a synagogue. <laughs> but because Joseph had the moral goodness to raise the surprise, we are safe and warm here in a Protestant church. Amen and Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas, Churchy. Reverend Putty? Yes, Oral? I agree with you that it was good that they didn't kill the baby Jesus before he was born. Oh, you think so, Captain? Uh-huh. But it's still too bad that grown-up Jesus had to die, even though he wasn't as cute. Oh, he'll be back. Really? Yep. In fact, he may already be here. There might be a little child right now running around somewhere who's the second coming. Cool. The second coming? But this time, he won't be as nice. I don't know. Sorry, Shape. Bye, Reverend. Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas, Oral. Mm -hmm. There we go. One last touch. Can I this year, Dad? Hmm. Well, I suppose you're old enough. It smells like a whole forest of lemons and hairspray. Mmm, <laughs> that it does. Okay, time for bed, boys. Santa's coming soon, and he knows kids who stay up late are jerks. No! Oral, tend to your brother. And try to keep him quiet, or he'll wake the neighbors. Yes, Mom. Good night. Good night. No! Are you decent? Hold on. Okay. Well, that was a mortifying sermon today. Oh, come on. Can't we have one good night? You know the Reverend was referring to you not wanting Shapey. That's ridiculous. How would he even know? Don't be an idiot. Everyone knows you didn't want him. Yeah, well, I had my reasons. I think it's kind of strange that I don't even remember conceiving this kid. Please, when do you ever remember? All I do is try to forget. At least you know he's yours. Please, God, let this be the best Christmas ever. Amen. Oh, and if Jesus is already back here on Earth, please tell him to come by so I can meet him. I'm sure you know he's been my personal hero for years now. Amen again. Gosh, if Jesus is around and nobody knows it, he'll be all alone on his birthday. And that's just not right. Hmm. I better go ask Dad, see what he thinks I should do. How did we even get here? Look, just get over it. How can I get over it? I never asked for a second child, and then boom, Shapey magically appears. Explain that. Shapey. But this time, he won't be as nice. Behold, the second coming of our Lord. Hallelujah! Oh, he doesn't even look anything like me. <gasps> Who's been inside you? You are disgusting. I want a divorce. Fine, I'm gone. Live it up, baby! Golly, this is going to be the best Christmas ever! <laughs> Yay! Christmas morning! Merry Christmas and happy birthday, First Jesus! And thanks for making my little brother the second you! Mom! Dad! It's the best Christmas ever! Uh, I have something important to tell you! Hey! Open up! You have to hear the good news! Oh well. I guess it can wait. I shall drum for you. Drum, drummy, drum. For the newborn baby king. Yeah, Dad! Yes, Lord. Ow! 
Oh. <laughs> Thank you, Savior. What's the new plan? Present, present, present. Maybe you should put on some... Lead the way, Lord. I follow. If the Lord were alive today... <coughs> What's the matter, Master? No presents. Oh, well, Mom and Dad aren't up yet, so... Hmm... If the Lord were alive today, what would you get him this Christmas? <gasps> Come on, Lord, get dressed. I'll get you a present. <laughs> Okay, okay, Christ child. Just wait out here. Yay, win! Nine! Yay! Shapey? Look, Shapey, I... The apocalypse begins. Yay! Stupid people. The Christ has spoken. Take that, heathen. Mrs. Puppington, Reverend Putty here. Merry Christmas. Speaking of Christmas... What are you two doing? <laughs> Mom, guess what? Dad isn't Shapey's father. I know that, Oral. Then you figured it out. Are Shapey's the second son of God? <laughs> I wish God was his father. Uh, where's Dad? He left home. We're splitting up. But it's Christmas. We can't spend it without him. Then I suggest you go find your precious father and the two of you spend Christmas together. If the Lord were alive today, what would you give him this Christmas? What do you give someone who has everything and more? He can heal the sick soul. Oh, cheer up, Clay. You've got a great family. You're an incredibly attractive guy, and your wife is automatically sexy by association. And Oral is one of the best long-distance runners on my team. Who cares if your second kid was a mistake and won't let himself be weaned? At least he's cute. Yeah, yeah. Don't worry, she'll never go through with the divorce. Thanks, Danielle. Sometimes I wish I could put your brain in my wife's head. <laughs> Merry Christmas, Clay. Merry Christmas. What would you give him this Christmas? Give him a twenty dollar gift certificate for Pizza Joe's. Mm -mm. Boy, God, this sure didn't turn out to be the best Christmas ever. But you still have two minutes left, and I have faith in you. Not here. But I've just told him you were. Woman, you kind of weird how the prize money for this thing is exactly the same amount we need to finish the Annihilatrix? No, I think it's weird that you question me every...
time. Moldering on the floor? Mm -hmm. Look at those little buggers. They are cute. <laughs> you see the little eyes and they're like tadpoles. That one blinked at me. Wonder what the rate of survival is. Or anything else? Okay, the first... And farm keyboard! <gasps> My god, the genius of it. It's basically a regular computer keyboard, but it's made of clear plastic. Do you like Xbox? Sweetie, I'm tired. Well, at least we got best presentation so I can get my furniture back. Yeah. There he goes. Where do you think he's going? Hey, I just came from here. You did? Wait, I did? Yeah. Uh-oh. Oh. Nice. Nice work. Didn't see that one coming. There goes that hand. Great. Your clothes, aren't they? Yes, they are. They sure are all of my clothes. some X dolls and they're gonna kick so much ass you'll probably go blind you're not gonna sell doll one without a villain you ninny check that out man that's a real super villain right there London calling going to freak out now and as God is my witness I will have my revenge on Xander Cruz You know, Christmas time can have a funny way of looking like any other time around our little valley. Today, f <laughs> good news on your talk screen, Santa. Not uh, tis, tis the season to be jolly. We'll start failing soon, <laughs> and the end will come quickly. <laughs> Hear you? What? Quick, look over there. Holy crap! You. <laughs> okay, uh, maybe later. I don't know. Jump, jump at the thing. Oh, oh. Uh, yeah. Yeah, baby. Oh, oh man. Oh, that's cute. <laughs> Daddy likey. Ooh, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I am Victor. Zorak, did you see that? What? The Tony Hawk game experience is so real. You just don't skate it. You feel it. In stores this fall. Rated T for teen. She is the team mom. Her boys are big, so she's big on Campbell's Chunky. Hearty meals to feed an NFL-sized hunger. Team mom, we salute you. Campbell's Chunky, meals that fill you up right. Our mission is to get in and kidnap Damien. MI3 is the number one DVD in America. It's the best Mission Impossible yet. Execute. Tom Cruise, Mission Impossible 3. Buy it on DVD today. Also available in high definition. Hey, you're the new kid. In a place like this, you're gonna need friends. Salutation, Sir James. Oh, I'm sorry, friends. Psycho, did oh. I hit your boyfriend? The school is filled with wild feet. We had a date, and you are three minutes late. Go away, Jimmy! No, no, no! Hey, Aggie. Please. I want you to stop bullying weak kids. Why? Goofy pants! Bully, rated T for T. These kids almost had a new community center. A contractor almost volunteered to build it. A carpenter almost worked on the crew. And everyone else almost gave at the fundraiser. They almost gave. Almost. 
And these kids? Well, they almost stayed out of trouble. only one vehicle left on the road. A spunk. Ah! Get in the house, now. Damn it, Sarah, I said get- What? Hey, Jermaine, how much did he pay you? Everybody shut up. Admit, I never did like you three. If you ask me, a bunch of creepy ghosts have no business in a cheery Christmas narrative. <laughs>